Good morning, I'm Dr Christine Selvey from New South Wales Health with a COVID-19 update for Wednesday the 26th of January 2022. Across New South Wales, more than 95% of people aged 16 years and over have received a first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine and 93.9% .9 have received two doses. Of the people aged 12 to 15 years, 82.8% have received a first dose of a COVID-19 vaccine and 78.3% have received two doses. Of people aged 5 to 11 years, 31% have received the first dose of a COVID-19 vaccine. And 35.1% of people in New South Wales aged 18 years and over have received a booster dose. New South Wales Health encourages everyone who is eligible to receive a vaccination, including their booster dose, to book in into a New South Wales Health vaccination clinic or another provider without delay. Book through the COVID-19 Vaccine Clinic Finder. Vaccination is the best way to protect yourself, your loved ones and the community from the harmful effects of COVID-19. There are currently 2,794 people with COVID-19 admitted to hospitals in New South Wales, including 175 people in intensive care, 75 of whom require ventilation. There were 21,030 positive tests notified to 8pm last night. This includes 12,918 positive PCR tests and 8,112 positive rapid antigen tests. Of the positive rapid antigen tests reported, 7,416 are from the past seven days. Sadly, New South Wales Health is reporting the deaths of 29 people with COVID-19, 17 men and 12 women. New South Wales Health expresses its sincere condolences to their loved ones. If you are unwell with COVID symptoms, please protect others. Do not go out to work, shop or socialise. Get tested and isolate until you receive a negative result. If you get a positive rapid antigen test, please register it on the Service New South Wales app and self-isolate from seven days from the day you were tested. You will get a text message from New South Wales Health after seven days, confirming the end of your self-isolation period. But you do not have to wait for this text to leave self-isolation if it has been seven days since you were tested. However, if you still have COVID symptoms after seven days, please remain in self-isolation until 24 hours after your symptoms resolve. If you are concerned about your symptoms, please call your GP. Again, thank you for your continuing efforts to get vaccinated, get tested and helping limit the spread of COVID-19 in New South Wales. Please stay safe. Thank you.